In this tutorial, we will guide you on how to create and clear arrays in Excel using VBA. Arrays are basically a group of variables which have similar properties. Instead of using multiple variables, it's better to use a single array. Now let's work on a simple code that asks you for student name and enters it on the sheet. In VBA, we declare an array the same way in which we declare a single variable, that is, through the dim statement. The name of the array over here is student name. Furthermore, we have defined the array as a string. Next, we will use the ForNext loop so that we can accept five inputs for the value. Now, instead of sorting each and every input in a different variable, we have called upon the array that we created earlier to store and represent the value on the screen. Now, let's head back to the sheet and see how it works. Great! The macro asked us for the input. Notice that as we enter the names, the data is entered on the sheet. Similarly, you can assign multiple arrays by separating them using commas. Over here, let's use the same code, but instead of using a single array, we will declare three arrays for different values. That's the student name, student ID, and his marks. With that done, we will include the array names in the for next loop as well, so that the user is prompted for the ID and marks as well. Let's open up the Excel sheet and double-click anywhere to run the code. You'll notice over here that after the name, the user is prompted for the ID and the marks as well. You can also clear the array at the end of the code by using the erase keyword followed by the array name, which you want to clear. This will basically free up the memory used to store the value. If we run the code now, notice how it prompts the user for the data, but doesn't store any of the values entered. And that's basically how you can create and clear an array in Visual Basic. Thanks for watching. This was a HowTech.TV tutorial.